well, we did everything we wanted other than uh, get that one goal we needed in the regulation or the overtime. I thought uh, the guys played hard. We had uh, ample opportunities, and uh, right now we're, we're having trouble uh, finishing. Well, Kent Patterson finishes off the weekend in Abbotsford with a nice debut in the American Hockey League. Looked confident out there. Just kind of tell us what you saw out of him. Exactly that. Uh, you know, I was happy for him uh, to get his first start and to get a shutout for the most part of of how they, they term it. I, I thought he was uh, real good and solid, and it was a game that, uh, you know, could have gone either way, so he showed some real composure in there. Now, drop three straight shootouts, but at the same time, points in the standings in nine out of ten games. And I know picking up points in the standings, that has to be encouraging to be able to do that every night, to be able to keep pace with the teams in your division. Well, this time of the year, there's no doubt. Back half of the season, you see a lot of three-point games, and uh, there's nothing worse than when you're on the other side of that and you're not getting any of the points. Obviously, you'd like to get the two, but uh, to get zero is even worse. So we'll, we'll take it for what it is. We got to bounce back here, get home, and uh, play an early morning game, and then we're back on the road. So. Uh, there's no let up and uh, I don't see any help from anybody else. We're going to have to do this ourselves. Now one last thing. Last season the Monsters played a team record 43 one goal games. This season 27 one goal games. Now what can a team learn from playing that many close games? Well you learn how to uh, win hockey games or you learn how to lose hockey games in the sense of the, the little details that come into play in the dying minutes or at certain points in the games that can change momentum and uh, they're great experiences to go through with the young hockey club and uh, you know generally when you get down the stretch or hopefully into playoffs there are areas that you, you, you build on or areas that you can draw from during the season that uh, will help you win.